Here we go. Tape number five. <laughs> yes. 2 0. Great win, wasn't it? Yeah. Really, really professional performance again. And uh, I'm just really happy with how we played. Um, again, coming here last game of the season, was, they're a good team. It's a nice 4G pitch, but we just have to keep our performance and our professional standards up. And I thought it was an outstanding way to finish off this season. And uh, it was lovely to see all the fans there clapping us off. And it, again, it, it's for them. Um, but I'm really happy now we've just kept another clean sheet, scored two very good goals and uh, we just looked in control all game to be honest with you. We absolutely did and they didn't even have a shot on target until the 83rd minute. Yeah and, and that's just a credit to how the lads are setting up off the ball and it's not a coincidence that like you say over these last few months we've worked really well hard off the ball shape and it just it's showing now because we're not leaking as many goals as we did but look I'm a uh, I'm happy with the win. I'm happy with how the boys have just signed off their season. Um, and I, we can go away now, have a couple of weeks with the family and rest up and uh, relax and uh, come back uh, stronger Absolutely. in the summer. When, when does planning start for next season? Uh, well, myself and Jed, we've already started planning. Obviously, we need to. Um, we need to make sure the pre-season uh, schedule's all in, in place uh, with teams and um that we're going to have to sit down with all the lads um, in the next week or two and just just basically hopefully get them all over the line for next year and then and then add but it's going to be a, um, a long summer but we knew last year was the same and we've just got to keep working together me and Jeb will have regular meetings and basher and, um, and, and we'll go again we'll identify players we want to try and bring to the football club to strengthen what we've already got and I just think with this togetherness which we have now like it is a, a real strong togetherness and um it's a special dressing room at the minute in the sense of we know, with what we've been through and now we've pulled it, we've, we've started pulling it together again. Um, it's a real strong place to be at and the lads that have come in over the last couple of months, Lee Vaughan who I thought was outstanding today, he's coming straight into the dressing room and even he is an experienced player, um, played in many dressing rooms and he, he, the first thing he says, that togetherness that you've got Gav, it's, it's, it's pretty special so if we can keep a lot of the players I know some players will have aspirations to go higher, which I hope they do. Um, but if we can keep this together, I think we'll uh, have hopefully a good pre-season and uh, we'll see what the next season holds for us, really. Can, can we let the cat out of the bag then? Or are you the first signing for next season? <laughs> Maybe. I might have to get on for, after training on Thursday. I think I could be. No, it was uh, we trained on Thursday. I, I did get the boots on. I think I was the best player as well. But, and we uh, don't want you playing, <laughs> no, but, you know, and, and we don't want you playing about your air and all that. <laughs> oh, you, know, right. you, know, you know what I mean? I don't, don't no, want, don't want I mean, that. for me, it's, it's been a, a real, for myself, a uh, tough year, but I've thoroughly enjoyed it. I've had, like I've said on a number of occasions, the support from Jed, and now I've got a backroom staff that all, uh, we work together, all have different skill sets that are, are really good. And, and for me, I'm really looking forward to to getting going again and having another season here at Stratford. So hopefully... Um, you're, you're really, really good at going around the hours. Yeah. Is, that, is that a yes, oh, Of course. Of course, man. I want to... <laughs> Would you like to see me here next year, Stuart? Hell yeah. yeah that's I wouldn't right. be bloody talking to you otherwise. <laughs> no. And we're not doing anything. You've done a great job. The team's come together really, Thank really well. So I think we're the best team in the league in the second half of the season. Yeah. And if we'd have started like that, we would have been up there where Tamworth are now with, mm. without a shadow of a doubt because you know the football has been absolutely fantastic the defence has stood strong and mm. the fact that you come to some place like this on a Mickey Mouse pitch and, <laughs> and, and stop them even shooting on goal until the 83rd minute is something special yeah no it's it the lads have worked and it's credit to the guys and uh, they've worked really hard Stu and it's it's so nice that we finish strong and uh, it's only what the team have deserved, the fans have deserved in this football club. It's just a shame that um, we couldn't start the way. But again, look, we move forward now. Um, we enjoy the break. We know hopefully where we have to improve on for next season. And um, I'm really looking forward to it. Gav, Thank cheers, you buddy. Thank you so much. Have a lovely summer. Adieu, mate. Right. See you, lads. <laughs>